Um, yeah, so I just wanted to say a few words. I written down some notes. Uh, it's not complete, so bear with me if I make typos and stuff. Uh, thank you everyone for making this moment so much, so much more meaningful uh, for both of us. Uh, what a journey. It's uh, not exactly been easy to make this happen. Um, so I do hope that you are really um, enjoying yourself, eating, chatting. Um, we tried our best to make this something special for both of us and for each one of you also. Um, so uh, I really appreciate uh, all the sacrifices that everyone has made to make it here. Your time, your efforts, uh, doing RTK tests, paying for 15 ringgit parking, all the people who have helped. Um, so to my family, um, I love you. Um, we've been through a lot, and I think in many ways, we've been closer than we have, uh, we are closer than how we have been, uh, we're closer than, we're closer than how we've been for a long time. Makes sense. Yeah. So, uh, I hope I can be a better son, a better brother, um, that we'll continue to be close, or even closer than before. Um, thanks, Jie, uh, for your big heart, your spirit, your faithfulness, and all your love to be here with me always. Um, thanks, God. Uh, can't see him. Um, for, uh, and and uh, Tristan. Um, thanks, God, for being the best big brother I could ever hope for. Your voice of reason and your caring heart is one that I've always admired. Jasmine, you have, you have been such a great support and help for us. Um, hope you're having a great time. Uh, Tristan, hope. Yeah. Okay, I'll talk to him later. Um, pa, Ma, uh, without you, I would not be here today. Um, not just physically, but all the things um, that you have taught me to be. Um, yeah, um, Pa, my father, um, thank you for always making us laugh, your words of wisdom. Ma, thank you for all your sacrifices for this family. We can never thank you enough. Uh, you're a great mom. For, forgive me for the things that I have done. Uh, I hope that my parents are proud of me today. For my new family, um, Su An, it's been such an awesome time knowing you. If someone pauses and tries to understand you, he or she will see someone with so much talent, strength and heart. Um, you love the people you love so much and I only hope I can be a good big brother to you as well. Uh, to Papa Lim, thank you for accepting me and teaching me how to be a strong, how strong a gentle man can be. Uh, to his daughters, and even to those who have even wronged you. So your kind heart follows after Jesus. And uh, thanks, oh yeah, and also thanks for the best pong tea that I've, I've ever eaten. <laughs> I'll try to also emulate it. Uh, yeah, um, to my extended family, uh, uh, see you on Vicky. I think you're the only ones representing my mom's side today. Thank you so much for coming. Um, hope we can be close and continue to keep in touch and help one another. Uh, like when we were young kids, Uncle Lau, family. Uh, thank you for coming. Auntie Ivy, Auntie Shirley and family, thank you for coming. My extended, my extended, ext extended new family, thank you so much. Uh, I'm missing out some names, I know. Um, my friends here, uh, Sulin, Patrick, uh, Zhexian, and wife, Aaron, Lillian, uh, Cynthia, and partner. Uh, people, people say I'm popular, but I do not have many friends. Um, you're the few friends that I can afford to have in this wedding, and every one of you are precious to me. Thank you for walking with me throughout the years. Um, and I must not forget Yo Ping, uh, last but not least, my first mentor in my long journalism career. Without you, uh, I would not have such, a, such strong principles about what, what is right and wrong in journalism. Uh, there are many people I have not mentioned, uh, last minute type all these things. Um, those who have stuck with me, Yvonne, help us tremendously, prayed hard for us. Thank you so much. And uh, to Yvonne Lim Suin, my sayang, my wife, uh, thank you. I knew I loved you before I met you. No, I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm actually joking. <laughs> but uh, I think I think God did, yeah? So I just want to say thank you for loving me, uh, regardless of how unworthy I feel. And that, uh, and that has made all the difference. Uh, you are my comfort, my strength, and I hope to be the same for you. Um, you're the one that makes me talk non-stop, and I want, never want to stop. <laughs> and you also make me want to be a better person for myself, for you, 
for our family. I'm sure things won't be... Uh... Sorry, sorry. Lost my train of thought. Uh... A bit of roses. Ah, sorry. I'm, I'm sorry things won't be a bit of roses. And in the future, there's going to be ups and downs. I hope and pray that we will hold fast, persevere. Uh, I know that even if I fail, and I undoubtedly will, uh, love never fails. Because we have chosen love, and we have chosen God at the center, and we have chosen his, this, uh, each other, and this is our commitment. And uh, speaking of prayer, I would like to again dedicate this time and my life to this person and God, Jesus Christ, Son and the Father, Holy Spirit. Without Him in my life, I would not be as alive as I am today. So I believe He is alive and with us at this very moment. So thank you, Father. Uh, uh, thank you, and I, I hope, I pray that He blesses us all. Yeah, that is all I have here. Okay, that's kind of hard to follow, but um, yeah, I just want to say a few words. I think Elson has um, said quite a bit, but I just want to share a few thoughts. So this morning, I was you know trying to process what it feels like to get married, right? So, you know, I, in being in my mid-30s, I have been through, uh, been for a lot of weddings prior to this. And each time I'm like, you know, bridesmaid or just attending and it's always like, wow, oh, so beautiful, wow, so this. But when it came to my turn, it feels strange. It's a strange feeling yeah. to go through, to, to be married, to go, to have a wedding of your own, to have all these emotions. And, <clears throat> but I think that after giving it a, a, a bit of thought, um, I think that one thing that, the only thing that I feel really is just thankful. I'm so thankful for everyone that came. We, we couldn't have a big wedding because of circumstances. We could only have 64 people. And all of you are the closest and the dearest to us. Um, so I just want to thank you so much to everyone um, you know, for making the time, making the trip. To just be here with us today means so much to us, really. Um, I also want to, <laughs> this is going to be bad, but <laughs> I also want to just want to say, um, I mean, my sister and my dad have spoken about, you know, us, our little family. It's just three of us. But, <laughs> how do I say this? Um, I mean, I'm just so thankful that, you know, my mom's family is here today. And GE and my IE and my Aku are here today. My cousin, Sufte, and Uncle Jyoti. Um, growing up without a mom, uh, it's, it's, it, it's, I don't know, I don't know what to compare it with, right? But <laughs> thank you so much. Uh, Majestic is great, man. Seriously. Do you want to get married? Get married here. Uh, yeah, but, yeah, I mean... No, I don't want to be emotional about it, but I'm just saying that, you know, growing up without a mom, it's a very surreal thing. And now getting married, you know, it just reminds me of her. And this um, morning before we walked down, my dad chose to <laughs> give me a hug and said that um, uh, this hug is from your mom. And I'm like, perfect timing, man, ba. Because <laughs> it was like waterworks the whole way. But, you know, I just want to... I just want to honor her today. Um, I can't say that she made me who I am today because you know she's she's been gone from my life for 24 years now. But she's still very much a, a part of us. And our little family of three, um, you know, she's I believe that when she when she left, she she told God that you know you gotta take care of them. And I stand here as a testament to God's faithfulness because take care of us, he did. He gave us a dad who is basically a superhero. He raised us single-handedly with the help of some family friends like Auntie Jennifer. He raised us single-handedly, um, uh, two girls, one man, <laughs> eventually a few cats here and there. <laughs> but he raised us single-handedly and so I just want to... I'll take this moment to just honour my father. Um, if you could all give him a round of applause. I know that some of you don't know him, la, but I want to honour him anyway. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's done an amazing job, really. Um, and also my sister, you know, she's been such an amazing support this, um, 
this wedding, she did so much. If you look at the beautiful reception booth out there, that's all her. Um, throughout this whole process, she's just been there. And so I just want to thank you so much. She's just been there for us um, the whole way. So, and also to Sok Ping, <laughs> who came all the way back from New Zealand in the middle of a pandemic <laughs> to honour a promise that she made as a child, you know. That is that is amazing, yeah. And also to to Lisa, my godsons, it's amazing to have so much love. Um, who are you pointing to? Huh? Why me? Right? Who came back all the way to? You know, thank you so much. So much love. Some of us we work together, like my friends from the star. I guess we can't say my friends from the star lah. Only some of us are still at the star, but you know, my friends who are my colleagues, and now we're so, we've we've been friends for a decade now. Amazing! I just want to thank you so much, so much for all the love, all the support, and for just being here with us today. Really, thank you.